MLAs from Chura Chanpur district, including LM Khaute, Paul Nial Saikot, and Led Zamang Hengleb, held a meeting with district administrations, including Chura Chanpur district commissioner, as well as officials of FCS and FCI, on Tuesday after the seizure of six truck loads of PDS rice in the district by the police. And in the meeting, it was decided that the district's supply office will be sole releasing and depositing authority of PDS rice in FCS and FCI go down. And the DSO was also instructed to work out a mechanism with the FCI officials so that there is no loopholes and the room for pilferage in future. Well, MLA LM Khauti also informed that the initiation of legal process for arrest of the responsible persons by the police would continue as follow. And we decided that the DSO should be the sole releasing authority for uh, PDS rice from the FCS, FCI go down for depositing in the FCS go down before it's being issued to the public assembly constituency wise. That is one discussion we had and we uh, instructed the DSO uh, to work out a mechanism with the FCI officials so that there's no loopholes and um, room for any pilferage in future. And that is one. As far as the um, incident is concerned, the police is aware, the police has initiated legal action and uh, legal process investigation as per law will continue. MLA from Saikot, Paul Enlal Haukip stated people have not been getting 100% of rice in the district and promised to look into the matter. Moreover, FCI will not be allowed to release any rice from FCI Godown unless the release order is signed by the DSO. Meanwhile, nominees of the MLAs have to be informed whenever the DSO has to lift rice from FCI for FCS.